to be more towards a person centric rather than a system or a patient centric mm. so instead of focusing that the ministry of health is there just to treat patients no it is there to promote health mm. to make the citizen more healthier that he will not going to be patient in the future yes. so most of the strategies and the vision currently implemented and currently in place is how to prevent diseases how to mitigate the risk of all the risk factors during adolescence and childhood to be able to have a healthy adult who's actually with less non-communicable diseases. We are one of the most uh, countries with number of patients with diabetes, with hypertension. So we would like to decrease that. It will not going to be achieved mm. if we are just treating patients. We would like to eliminate the risk factors, especially food, nutrition, lifestyle, and this is actually the, role, the new role and the vision of the Ministry of Health. Not hospitals only, but also to promote public health and better health for individuals. Mm -hmm. Yes, for the past uh, decade, how do you see the initiatives made by mm -hmm. President Abdel Fattah Hassisi, the presidential initiatives to be eliminating virus C, for example, not just in Egypt, but yes. for Africa yeah, uh, as well, uh, to be eliminating uh, breast cancer for women. Uh, those initiatives by President Abdel Fattah Hassisi, do you mm -hmm. think that there is a chance that they will be continuing for the upcoming decade as well? In the yes, so, uh, since the launch of the presidential initiatives for public health at 2018, that was actually the main thing that we are actually open the discussion with the bridging the bridging between how to decrease the disease itself and to prevent diseases in the future the prevention of virus C and the elimination of virus C the main objective is to make Egypt free of the virus mm. and this will pave the road that we don't have for example hepatite, uh, hepatic uh, cancer yes. we're not going to be having all the hazards and the complications of hepatitis C will be having more productivity because most of the hepatitis C patients are less or no at all, not at all productive. Mm. So this will be the bridge from having presidential initiative for patients till we do have, for example, a presidential initiative for public health prevention like smoking cessation, for example. Mm. This is not a disease, but it will be a risk factor that will prevent and eliminate in the future, hopefully, lung cancer, for example, yes. uh, COPD, uh, asthma, and decreasing uh, the carbon footprint and having more green country. Mm -hmm. So yes, it will continue. It is a vision of the country to continue with the public health initiative. The presidential initiative will continue till we do have an umbrella with a reimbursement insurance system covering 100% of the Egyptians. And when we achieve that, the presidential initiative will be just a built-in function in the system. We don't need to have it a separate department as a yes. public health. It will be within the system itself and it's expected to be like that in 2032.